Hello everyone and welcome back to Dual Valley Save the Day Challenge by Rusty Money Gaming and I am filling up diesel I have right now as you can see 373,000 liters of diesel and it has taken me just around six hours to get here that is too slow yeah I've set this up just to load diesel while I was doing a lot of stuff around in the town so yeah i'm gonna stop here i'm gonna sell this and then we're gonna place down another cell buying point sorry buying point for diesel i don't know actually right now we got eighty five thousand, as you can see i don't know if we got if the multi buying point can give us diesel actually but well, as you can see, we're gonna get a lot of money right here, right now. Are, are we millionaires? We are millionaires. <laughs> That's cool. So, right now the time is 5 p.m. And we're gonna get some sleep in a moment. But I think that we have the train right here, first of all. I think I just want to try the buying point over here buy everything don't do this at home guys i hope you all doing well i have looking forward to this episode because the colossus got an epic update and i have updated that mod and now we're gonna collect stones as well because we got a great stone picker that's for sure And today we're gonna get small, small cotton bales from the Colossus 7000. So I'm a little bit excited to do that because I have not used it yet. I've not tested it. So I've only saw that Looney Farm Guy has tested that. So yeah, it's gonna be interesting. Oh, we can do diesel. Yeah say what you want guys we're gonna try this oh it's so fast i really want to try to sell 500,000 liters of diesel and that will be right now and when you look at that 500,000 liters and we paid 375,000 for that and you know what right now we're gonna sell it i'm gonna drive up to the to the shop because that is the best price for diesel up there and but then we're going to sleep just a silly start here and i love it right here on this map we can do things like this and that is so cool i am also doing the millennial farms it is a little bit more serious gameplay so if you like a little bit unrealistic gameplay then you are on the right spot at the right time because right now we're gonna sell 500,000 liters of diesel and we did pay 375,000 for that and let's see what we can sell this for this is crazy I am a diesel distributor simulator gameplay <laughs> i don't know what it costs look at the money guys that is crazy oh man that's crazy so we did pay 375,000 and we got 1.5 million man don't do this at home <laughs> well tomorrow we're gonna get a little bit more serious because we got the cotton harvester down at the new cotton field and then we're gonna harvest that cotton so we can get that in the spinnery that will be amazing and then we're gonna buy ourselves a little stone picker also from the colossus and we're gonna pick stones from this field up here behind so yeah and then we're gonna see the rest up there I will have the Omatana Fermenter here on the map, so yeah. 
gonna turn off the beacon, the light, the engine, and then we're gonna find ourselves a little tent. And I'm gonna see you tomorrow. Good morning! Welcome to June! The time is 8 a.m. And that was a good night of sleep. I think I want to have mm, a little farmhouse, a proper farmhouse. So we're gonna get into that. First of all, we're gonna take the Unimog up to the field. Um, let me just see. No. And yes, I can take the cedar with me up to the shop because I want to buy that stone picker so we can pick up the stones. I want to see it from the outside. There we go. As you can see, it is heavy. I want to pick up the stone, so we're gonna put this up at the shop for now, and then we're gonna uh, buy the stone picker, I think, and then we can... Oh, the sheep have a lot of wool for us, that is good. And then we can pick up the stones while we're gonna harvest the cotton. Oh man, that will be amazing. But first of all, you know what? I think we're gonna take all the wool up to my spinnery so we can keep that going. And I have no idea how it goes with the all my productions and so on and so forth. But the stone picker I want, it is right here, there. And I think we're gonna go with Mmm, the unrealistic, I can see that, there we go, working with, we're gonna go with, yeah, 25 meters, yeah, I think that is good, and the speed here, no, I'm gonna bump that down quite a bit, um, design, what is that, EU, yeah, that looks quite good with those signs there, beacons, we're gonna go with orange beacons, and we're gonna go with the blue here, the blue lines and capacity. We're gonna go with 25,000 and color, not pink, but Titus blue, of course. We're gonna go with that. Yeah, that looks good. I can hear the rain outside right now. Man, it's raining. That is crazy. The time here is right now 1 p.m. and it is almost dark as night. That's crazy. So I think we just can get the Unimark to pick up stones. Oh, look at that. Little stone picker. Man, that's good. And we got... Uh oh We got, of course, the beacon here. Oh. Yeah. That looks badass. Man, this is cool. It is a little bit bigger than I thought. I'm not used to pick up stones. Can we get over the bridge? I don't know. But we're gonna look into that. Oh, man. Oh, I forgot the wool. I'm just gonna do this and I'm gonna drive all my wool over to the spinnery and then I'm gonna see you when I have this stone picker again. Whoops, accidentally I got the time up to 11 a.m. That was not my... Yeah, I was wrong, but... Oh, we got clothes over here. And there we go, 6,000 liters of... Uh -oh, we cannot do this. Can we not have more in here? Yeah, we can. Hmm... Maybe I need to be a little bit closer to the unloading area. There we go. And what do we have here? We got, we got, we got a wedding dress, a wedding dress. No tuxedo. Where is my tuxedo? Wedding dress. Okay, so. And that is a... What, how much is there in here? Only 400 liters and Rusty Money Gaming, we need 5,000. Uh -oh. 
Yeah, we're gonna bump it up with some cotton today. I don't think it is much, but a little bit of cotton is okay. Oh man. The wedding dress. It's not good like this. Okay, we're gonna just do this. Don't look at the quality here because <clears throat> yeah, that's not good. Well, that's the way it is. I'm not a designer. I am a farmer. I'm a digital farmer. That's for sure. So the reason why I load this up is because we got the unload over here so we can have it in storage. There we go. And it is right there. And it is under the ground, but that's okay. And then we got some very interesting over here. Oh yeah, look at this. Diamond rings. Hmm, that is nice. That is very nice to see. And we can just do it like this. That is quality. <laughs> and then we're gonna drive this over here as well. There we go. And then we're gonna get the stone picker. Just over here. I will go look at this. Uh oh, stop! Stop! <laughs> and then we can pick up the stone picker. Maybe. And can we get over the bridge? We can try just barely. Ah, plenty of space. That is nice. And I think we got stones over in the field to pick up, so let's check that. I think it was 25 meters this could pick up, so when I do the course play, then I have to set it to 25 meters. Oh, uh oh, uh oh. There we go. Let's do this together, shall we? We have to go in here, create job. And we are right there. Are we gonna. Yeah, that's good. Recognize. Oh, it recognized the 25 meters working with. That is very cool. Sharp corners. That is good. Automatic. We don't want to do any bypass. Generate. Oh, look at that. So let's check if we got stones here at all. It would be quite interesting to see. And look at the blue line. And uh, we got stones. That is cool. Didn't don't get all the way out here, okay? Offset, we don't want to do a offset. There we go. Yeah, that's cool. I like it, I like it, I like it. We're gonna let him do that because now we're gonna go with the cotton harvest and I have set it to 231 centimeter bales because we don't need the big bales on this field because the field is not that big. Yeah, we just have to go in here and, and do this. Yeah, this is the field. I think we're gonna sell the field afterwards. And I also told you that the last time, I think, as far as I remember. Six meters, this is not unrealistic. So we're gonna go with two headlands. But we're gonna start on the center because of the bales. 
and we're gonna make it sharp corners and 10% in overlap and no bypass we go oh this will be cool oh that's nice guys And what about the working speed? I need to set that down because I don't want a big working speed at all. We just want to drive 12 kilometers power. There we go. And let's take a look here. Yeah, we're gonna get small bales. That is good. That is very, very, very good. Oh man. We have the first cotton in the house. Man, that's nice. Look at the color. I really like this Tadis blue here. I think it is quite nice. Uh, we're almost at the first bail. No, not yet at all. Oh, that's the stone picket over there. Cool. <laughs> yeah, that's cool. So maybe we don't need the mines. Oh yeah, be yeah, because the the stone processing unit can hold. 500,000 meters of stone, so... Oh, what about the automatic drop? We need that. Uh, um, can I do that right now? Will the worker do that himself? I don't know. But a beautiful, beautiful area to harvest cotton in, that's for sure, with the water and the view, the bridge here in the background and the mountains and oh it's beautiful it is very very beautiful so we got 2.3 million and yeah look at the cotton bales it is so small what is it 2520 20 what I think 2,500 liters, perhaps. And then we're gonna use the... There is a bale collector for this as well. And we're just gonna use that. And I will see you when we are done. Oh, well, this has been an okay job, I guess. But... You know what? I don't want to have this um, part of the job with regards to the field work, so I think we're gonna sell this again and we're gonna stay without stones because, you know, 4,000 liters? Nah. Nah. I don't wanna do that, but this is a clever mod. And. 4,000 liters of stone is plenty if you're gonna do lime or something like that, but for this, you know, for, for this map here, with all the stones we need, then I don't want to do it. I have bought the bell collector over here. Oh, so we can pick up the bales and get that production going yeah but first of all we're just gonna sell this again i think it is right here there we go we don't want to do anything about this we're just gonna sell it and say goodbye to that and then we have tried that so this is the bell collector also from the colossus pack so we can pick up also the small 2500 liters of 
Cotton bales. Yeah, the Unimog is on work today. There was a little bit issue with the cotton harvester. When it has unloaded a bale, then cosplay stopped to work, so I have to start cosplay every time a bale was dropped. So, yeah, but that's okay. That's okay. When we got the big field with cotton, then we just can make bigger bales, and then the problem is not that big. And then we can see it in here afterwards. Oh. Oh man, I've not tried to use a bill collector like this before, I think, so mm, can we shut, do we have to turn it on or something like that? No. So what to do? Can you please tell me that? Oh, oh, there we go. I just need to see if the if there is a bale in here we have to unload. Um, I think we can unload bale. No. Turn off automatic drop. What if we're gonna do that? And then unload. No. Uh, guys, can I not do that? Can I not unload a bale? I thought I had the unload um, early bales or what you what it calls. Hmm. No. Okay. What if I turn on this and this? No. Ah, okay. There we go. We cannot get that bail. That is not good. So how will this work? Ooh, look at that! It is a 2500 liter spell, I think, so... And we can have three bales only, but that's okay. Oh, we also do got some cotton right there, and we don't need that much. Maybe we can get one more bale, that could be awesome! But well, first of all, we really, really need to drive those bales here up to the production. Yeah, we're gonna do that. Let's turn this off again. We need to drive this way around, unfortunately, but that's the way it is. And I'm gonna sell that field again. I don't want that field. I just bought it because there was cotton ready to harvest on it. Oh, that is good. That is very good. So we need to bring the cedar back to the field so we can see oh, grass in the field. We just picked up stones. Yeah, we got a lot of things to do. We're just gonna cross over the grass field here and then we can unload the bales. I don't know how to unload, actually. Uh, maybe this is just, yeah, that's the same way. Okay. Yeah, that was good. And then I'm gonna harvest the last bit and see if I can get one more bale. Maybe I can. 
And I'm gonna see you a little bit later. Well, in total we got 15,000 liters of cotton. That is very, very good. I'm just gonna bring this over to the spinnery right here. And I just want to check a little thing. If I can get those pellets out there on there, they are in the concrete, so... Well, first of all, we're gonna unload those bales right here. There we go. And that one, and the last one as well. There we go. And we're gonna check in here. The production, spinnery. Oh, look at that. That is very good to see. We're gonna activate that as well. So let's check this. that good they are in looks looks very very bad so where is my trigger uh, this right here i think no yeah oh that is it okay right here so we got five of, of those yeah okay we got it we got it so i think i think everything is good right there and then we can take the trailer with us back. I'm a... Yeah, I'm a little bit... I don't know if I'm gonna keep the cotton harvester because we also got the new bio baler and I think that will be better... a better suit for this map. The, the, the cotton harvester is very big. So we got to look into that and then I think we cannot use this bail collector here then we're gonna have to use a in-game bail collector perhaps yeah I think so we're gonna set that trader right there and as you can see we got the cotton harvester over here behind and yeah it is big now we gonna seed some grass on the new field and we gonna take the new bridge i did remember that huh yeah that's good we got 2.2 million so we don't need money that's for sure and look at this look how heavy this cedar is for this unimog are you ready Oh, yeah. A proper workhorse, for sure. And then we're gonna go over here to the JCB with the cedar, and we can take the plow to the farm with this one here. Then we can seed some grass, yeah. <laughs> and we just can put the cedar right here and then we're gonna take the plow and we're gonna get a big grass field here that's for sure i don't know if i have the omatana fermenter installed oh, like that let's check that now we go production factories and uh, we're gonna check here that will be a no so i'm gonna get the omatana production eventually i get that installed and i think we're just gonna pack this one right here We need to turn off the engine, right? There we go. And now it is time to seed the field with the grass. We are in June. 
but I don't know where where we are in the world because of June and it is cold and yeah it is a little bit weird actually come on there we go and then we can start to seed some grass right here it is a big cedar so it won't take long time we gotta do its thing and we're gonna lower what is going on oh man there we go I do have access to this, you know. So. Oh, we did miss a little bit there. Man. We're gonna get uh, quite a big grass field here. And uh, we got the proper tractor for the mowers now. We didn't have that before, so I'm not concerned with regards to that. There we go. Yeah, this is nice. Little bit slow right here. But I think we also are the right on the horsepower limit. Yeah. I think we are. Twelve kilometers power. It is a little bit slow, right? So this is going well. I'm just sitting here and watching a burger. <laughs> a burger that is seating for me, so yeah, it's quite nice and cozy. And it is going good. We have used 20% of the seeds and we have done a lot of work already. So everything is good. And this tractor here is just pulling this cedar like nothing. So that is very good news right there. And I don't know actually why I'm seeding grass and what to make silage to sell because look at the money. <laughs> why are we doing that? That is a little bit stupid perhaps. So yeah, that's the way it is right right now. We can go in not here, follow Mike. That was wrong. We're going in here and then we can sell this field again. We're gonna get 93,000. We don't want to own that. So yeah, we're doing good, we are doing good, that's for sure. We just, we still miss this little spot here, but that's okay. Don't drive into the water, thank you. With my new JCB. ABC. <laughs> oh, okay, so... Yeah, I think actually just we're gonna end right here because I do not have that much else to do. And next time I'm gonna see you will be in July or August or something like that. So we can make a little bit of progress. And when we're gonna harvest the big cotton field, we're gonna use the bio baler. I'm gonna sell the... Actually, we can do that right now because I... Yeah, I don't want it. I don't want it. We're gonna sell this. And then I'm gonna buy the bio baler to the next time. And then we can... Maybe we can harvest that cotton field next time with the bio baler. That could be a little bit awesome to do that. I'm looking forward to do a bio baler for... For cotton harvest, yeah. <laughs> but I think that is quite cool. A nice addition to the game. We have a lot of cool mods lately, so that will be a promising 
Mm, not a world for FS25, I think. Thank you for watching. Take care of yourself and be safe out there in the big world. Bubble Mike is out of here. Bye bye.